All right, everybody, I am over here in White Belt Corner. And for you students, you guys probably remember your first class being right here in this corner. And for your future students, your first class will probably be in this corner. So I decided to film here because I think it is very appropriate to take a look in this very corner, one of the first things that you will ever learn, which is, in today's video, punching. Okay guys, now we're getting into our punching. So there are some very big key points for our punches that we want to look into. So looking at our hands, okay? So obviously with our hands, we bring our fingers in, we close them tight, and then our thumb comes over top. But why? Obviously we know not to put our thumb inside because when we strike something, right, our thumb goes in and boom, okay? So our fingers go down, thumb comes over top. When we're punching, we actually want to try and have it so that these two right here, these two knuckles right here, be the ones to strike, okay? We want those ones there to be the ones to strike because as you can see, our thumb is lying right over. And when you clench it hard, okay, you can see here, if we go really close, right, that my pinky will go in, my ring finger will go in, but my middle finger, it's very hard to go in because I'm clenching it with my thumb, okay? Index finger barely moves, okay? And I'm pushing pretty hard, okay? So that's why this thumb comes across, all right, and it's holding it there, all right? So every time that you throw a punch, okay, onto the bag now, when we throw our punch, square like this, aiming for these two, it will be hard, okay? It will be hard to get these two on the bag like this, okay? It's very rare to get a perfect punch, but the more we practice it, the more we'll have it so that that part of our fist strikes, right? Whatever we're punching, all right? Also when we're punching, not too many people look deep into this part, but when we're punching, we actually want to twist out a bit, okay? And this gives us torque in our punch, okay? So when we throw our punch like this with a little twist, think of it as a bullet, okay? A bullet will spin, and when we spin, we create a little bit more of a piercing effect where it's going to leave a good mark, okay? On whatever we strike, all right? So with our punching, making sure that this thumb is tight over these two fingers, your index and your middle finger, right? Nice and tight so that it doesn't go in. Okay, now this will not eliminate uh, potential injuries from striking with these two, okay? But you will have a better chance at not getting injured than if you were to hit with your rain or pinky finger because it's more likely to go in and damage your knuckle, okay? So the more you squeeze tight on here, the more you'll eliminate the chances, okay? Not eliminate completely, eliminate the chances of you hurting or damaging your two knuckles, your middle finger and your index finger knuckles, okay? So with your punching, you guys can practice, hopefully on something, I hope you guys can find something to practice on, right? With these punches. So just keep in mind those key points where thumb over, tight grip, right? That little bit of torque when you're throwing your punch, okay? And obviously you guys can try it with a couple stances and those dance videos, you'll be seen very soon. Okay guys, thank you very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope that it was very useful for your review and maybe even learn something new about it. So be sure to like and subscribe and keep an eye out for the next technique review video.